Well, today, the internet received news that Spider-Man will no longer be in the Marvel Cinematic Universe for reasons we will very briefly discuss, and then we will move forward into taking a look at the internet's reaction to this news. Already, though, there are petitions being started to boycott Sony and to try to bring Spider-Man back into the MCU. More on that coming right up. First, let's recap the news very, very quickly. From comicbook.com, it reads, It seems the impossible has come to pass. After striking a deal to bring Spider-Man into the Marvel Cinematic Universe years ago, the tentative relationship with Sony and Disney has floundered. According to a new report by Deadline, the two studios entered a standoff resulting in Marvel Studios president Kevin being removed from Spider-Man's future. I can never pronounce that dude's last name. And the internet has, well, uh, they have a lot to say. Not long ago, fans were treated to the shocking news that Disney and Sony Pictures are part, uh, parting ways. Excuse me. Deadline reports a standoff between the studios over co-financing did not work out for Peter Parker in the end. After Disney asked for more profit cut of the Spider-Man films, Sony Pictures decided to go without. As the report says, Marvel Studios executive like uh, Kevin will have nothing to do with the Queen's hero moving forward. And finally... It looks like things are going to go south for Spider-Man and the MCU. Disney was eager to refinance a deal with Sony Pictures that would give them 50-50 split moving forward, but no deal was to be had. In return, Sony offered back the deal Disney originally went with to gain access to Spider-Man, but the 5% first dollar terms did not impress them. A deal was not made, and with little to no negotiation to go on, the tough decision was made to separate. And now we will get into the internet's reaction. I wanted to cover that segment briefly, because I don't think I'm the best source for comic news. I know a little bit about the industry, but I know much more about the anime industry. So while uh, I try to keep up to date with the comic stuff, I think there's still better sources that might know more about the inner dealings between Disney, Sony, Marvel, etc. But that's the gist of it as far as I understand. There might be more to it. But now I want to take a look at, uh, as I said, the internet's reaction to this news. Now we will go scroll through some tweets, starting with this one. It reads, well, guess I'm not giving Sony any money until they give Marvel Spidey back. Boycott Sony Spider-Man. I will not sit back and let Sony ruin another Spider-Man franchise. I will not give them another cent until Spider-Man is back in the MCU. Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man. Give us back Peter Parker. Give us back Peter Parker. Give us back Peter Parker. Times like eight more of those. Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man. The MCU was literally setting up the Sinister Six and Norman Osborn. FHH directly involved characters like Tony and Fury and left a huge cliffhanger for Peter. Civil War, Infinity War, and Endgame involved Spider-Man heavily, and now nothing will make sense. Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man. What's funny about that is I tweeted it the other day too. I finally saw Endgame like three days ago. Finally saw it after all these months. And uh, I was expecting it to be a little better. I liked Infinity War more. I don't want to get into all the reasons about that. This would be a very long video if I did. Yeah, so let's continue on this stuff. It's just odd timing. It's official. Sony Pictures hates us. No one wants to watch a Spider-Man movie without our fearless leader, Kevin, behind it. They're taking the greatest comic book character of all times out of the greatest cinematic universe of all time. Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man. Hashtag fire Tom Rothman. I hate you, Sony. Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man. Too bad. Really wanted to play the next Spider-Man game. Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man. Tom Holland is the best Spider-Man. You are gonna regret this. Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man. I like Tom Holland too, by the way. I think he does a great job. Get it trending. Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man until they give him to Marvel. What a joke. By the way, if you're curious what is trending, basically everything trending almost is related to Spider-Man. Take a look at this. Spider-Man 3, trending. Miles Morales, trending. Spidey, trending. Kevin, trending. Uncle Ben, trending. And Sony, trending. And cut off the list is Venom, trending. Back at the tweets, though. Sony has proved from time and time again that they cannot make a good Spider-Man saga. They ruin everything. Hashtag boycott Sony. Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man. Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man. I usually join, uh, don't join in on these boycotts, but Sony Pictures has made the stupidest decision I've heard in a while. I was having a good day today until Sony had to ruin it. Darn them for ruined your day. How dare they ruined your day. Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man and even an angry emoji in that one. This person's day is ruined. Nobody says nothing. Sony says, I'm bored. Let's ruin everything and take Spider-Man out of the MCU. Me, 
boycott Sony Spider-Man. By the way, guys, I'm very proud of myself. It took me a while to decipher how to read this meme format. format. Quick lesson for anyone who doesn't know, maybe I'm the only one who didn't know and I'm just a pleb, but this meme was a little confusing at first and then I realized that's how you got to read it. Nobody says that, nothing's there. Sony says this, so then you read that, me, and then, you know, that. Because I know the, like, nobody thing kind of throws people off for that meme, I think. Anyways, let's continue on here. Don't watch these movies until they bring hashtag Spidey with a Spidey emoji. Whoa, that's meta. To the MCU. Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man. Says don't watch these movies. And uh, there was a long list there. I couldn't paste the whole list. It would be way off the screen. But it's a list of all of Sony's future releases for their movies coming up. So this person saying don't watch these movies until they bring Spidey back to the MCU. Again, further boycotts. Continuing. Thank you, Sony Pictures, for ruin something incredible. Whoa. Is this like the long lost sibling of the other person who tweeted about ruined? Look at this guys. This is interesting. Um, I was having a good day today until Sony had to ruined it. Thank you. Sony pictures for ruin something incredible. Both of them kind of <laughs> have a little, little tough time with the ruin and ruined, uh, you know, how to use the word or something. I don't know. Listen, people are, are distraught over this news. I get it. It's, it's unfortunate. I don't like the news either. It's not good. Uh, but the MCU, you know, it's been having kind of bad news for a while, unfortunately. I hope you lose some money in the box office. Boycott Sony Spider-Man. The tweet finishes off and continuing. Whoa, this one's a... Uh, hold up. Almost cut off there. At Sony Pictures. Sony, give us back Peter Parker or perish. Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man. Give us back Peter Parker or perish. Post a little sad dog. I think that's a dog. Who knows? Sony is going to flop. Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man. Ooh, another meme. I like these memes. Uh, whoa, hold up. This one's really cut off a lot. There we go. Me, when Sony tries to release another Spider-Man movie after pulling it from the MCU. Do y'all hear something <laughs> with a Squidward? Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man. Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man with the middle finger at Sony Pictures. You won't be getting any more of my cash. There you go, Sony. Oh, there's the... We already saw this one. I must have a duplicate there. Continuing. Don't ever take away Spidey from the MCU at Sony. Bitch, please. You only care for your money, not for the fans who love the character, which is originally not, not yours because it's a Marvel property. Thanks for ruining my day. There you go. You got it that time. Uh, obnoxious face, dep sad, ang I don't even know what those emojis are. Boycott Sony Spider-Man. Moving on. Continuing. Why did they need to do this to us? I hate them. Whoa. Boycott Sony Spider-Man. I am so upset by this frown or sad face. Boycott Sony Spider-Man. What happened? Boycott Sony Spider-Man. Sony removing Spider-Man from the MCU after FFH became the highest grossing spider film makes no sense. I'm so heated right now. Hashtag boycott Spider-Man. Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man. Can we get this trending? Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man. That, I mean, maybe that'll be trending next. A lot of stuff is already trending now. And uh, here's another one. I, for one, will not be spending money on a non-MCU Spider-Man. Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man. Oh, oh, wow. This is, a, this is another meme that's cut off a little bit. Here we go. Oh, you think you've seen fans being upset? You ain't seen nothing yet. Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man. Boycott Sony ain't nothing like a triggered Marvel fan. Sorry, Spidey Far From Home re-release, Venom 2, Morbius, Miles Morals 2. I won't be seeing any of y'all, but I wish y'all luck. Bye. And another one. At Sony is clearly being run by a bunch of morons. Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man. The first hashtag I've ever been personally motivated by. Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man. Well, look at that, Sony. You are motivating people. That's kind of a good thing, right? Although, unfortunately, it's not really good for you what they're motivated to do. But hey, it's something. And only two more to go. Way to go at Sony. What a way to ruin a billion dollar franchise. Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man. And finally, I don't think there has ever been movie news that has floored me as much as Sony stupidly refusing a new Spider-Man contract with Marvel. Hashtag boycott Sony Spider-Man. So there you go. There is the news somewhat. Again, I want to reiterate, I am not the best source for the comic book news. So if you want further updates or more information, I would highly advise you to seek that out, whether it's a news article somewhere or another YouTube video, whatever it is, might be a good idea. 
But I do hope you enjoyed this video. I wanted to focus on the fans' reactions, the internet's reactions to this news. There might be further updates to come. We'll see if Boycott Sony Spider-Man ends up trending, probably has a pretty good shot at it. I think the only reason why it might not trend is because there's different boycott hashtags right now that are being used. So the people need to figure out one consistent one to use. For example, we saw Boycott Spider-Man, Boycott Sony, Boycott Sony Spider-Man, you know, uh, one of those probably get trending. We'll see though. So maybe I'll have another update in this video. Maybe not. We will see. Hopefully something gets worked out and the fans can be happy. At the end of the day, that's really all I care about. I mean, I also feel for Tom Holland. I think he liked this role a lot. And like I said, I think he did a good job. Uh, but again, I don't know how that whole situation will work out. And uh, I guess we'll find out. And now some shout outs for the wonderfully kind people who helped promote my last video over on Twitter. And again, uh, extra thanks for that one. I mean, always appreciate it, my friends. But especially that video was highly important. So a double thank you and shouts out to Micah J, Pyro577, Dark Guy with Shades, Pyroceptive, Hatred Everywhere, The Lancaster Kid. Wait, did you change it? I swear it used to be that Lancaster Kid. Maybe not. Matt B, Jame U2, Jeffrey R, CG Gaster, Crispy No Ken, Jan Brucken, Von Brucken, my bad, Von Brucken, Max, Shadow, Joe Frago. <laughs> Man, that guy, that guy is a, an interesting fella. Jelly Bean. Mr. Anime 343, Tyson, Tenshi Yuki, and Agent Under Baron. Thank you all for your assistance again in promoting that video. Much appreciated. I would highly enjoy seeing you guys in the Discord server if you're not there already. Link in the description. Almost at 4,000 members, you can help us get there. And if you'd like to do a bit extra to support this channel and the content we are creating, first, you can, of course, like the video, subscribe, hit the notification bell. And if uh, you're still wanting to do even more, we have a Teespring merch store and a Patreon in the description below. And that's it for this one. I will catch you next time.